Hello everyone, this is Orlando from A Collector's Dream. And today I'm gonna to show you some uh, Michael Jordan cards. And I'm gonna actually open a pack of a rare Michael Jordan cards. Two rare Michael Jordan cards that are in this pack right here. So I'm gonna open that up. But before I do that, I'm gonna take that out. I found this, I had this a long time ago, and I've never opened it. It's from um, Spain, and it's actually a game. It's a card game, a Spanish card game. It's called Four, Four Nears, and it's called Estrellas NBA, which is Stars of the NBA. So there's a 33, there's 33 cards in here. So there it is, 33 cards made in Spain. And this is from 1988. And one of the cards, the header card, is this one here, which is a beautiful card on Michael Jordan, young Michael Jordan. And um, about 5,000 of these Jordan cards total have been graded by PSA. And that may sound like a lot, but definitely not a lot compared to something like this. This card here is another Michael Jordan. This is an 89 Michael Jordan. And this card has been graded 50,000 times. 50,000 times. Yeah, I said that right. 50,000 times already. I personally have graded some of these myself, uh, trying to get nines and tens. Unfortunately, I didn't get anything higher than an eight and a half and a bunch of an eights. So I uh, still have some more that I did not grade because they were not perfectly centered. So um, here they are. Those are my raw ones. The other ones I did sell. And um, <clears throat> I also um, graded uh, another Michael Jordan card, which I sold last year's national, which is this similar to this one here, which is also um, a Spanish issue. These are stickers. These are Spanish stickers from 1986, which is essentially a, uh, a Jordan rookie. And I did grade that one, it came out of three because most of these are way off centered. This is the Dr. J card of that same series. And uh, I, I sold it at last year's National. I just took it to the National, I had a graded a three, I sold it. And it was the Michael Jordan of this. And this is the uh, Spanish and the Spanish. Uh, these are called the Super Canasta, Super Canasta stickers. And they come in little wax packs. They're stickers, they're stuck in the books. And they also come with um, logos from the ABA, NBA teams and stuff like that. So very similar to this one here. And um, there's just, I'm gonna show you some early, before I get to opening that, I'm gonna just show you some other Jordan cards that I had early Jordans, like this one here. I had. I opened tons of these when I was uh, younger, and this is another the following year, so I have tons of these. I also sent some of these to get graded, and unfortunately, um, again, didn't get any tens out of it. So I uh, just went ahead and uh, sold the ones that I got, and I just have so many of them already from all the packs that I opened. So, and this is another one here. This is a 1990 Jordan. The 1990 set, these are all the same. The 1990 set also had uh, some others in the same set. And, um, and here's another one here, the, the Jordan, and that's these here. The All-Star Team Jordan also from that same year. So I got a bunch of those too. So I'm just gonna share some of the Jordans that I got here, some of the earlier Jordan cards. And then on top of that, they also had the league leader card with Jordan that same year. And, and these, again, these you'll find these very cheaply, but if they are do grade like a 10 or stuff like that, they get to be very expensive because the, the borders are really, really tough to find and in good condition. This is the league leader card for the Jordan. Same year, 91 fear. 
league leader, Michael Jordan, the ultimate weapon. He sure was. So that's some uh, <clears throat> Jordan cards. I wanted to, before I get to opening that pack, show you some of those. And then I have some other Jordan cards. This one here, these are just some early Jordan cards. This is a, I like this one here because this has, I love the back, him playing. And that's the 90 Sky Boss of him playing, so we'll leave that like that, playing golf. And then just a few other random Jordan cards that I'm gonna just uh, show some early Jordan cards. And um, I got this one here. Jordan nuts and bolts. And that's like a metal card. It's a from the Fleer metal. And it's really neat because it's got a lot of, uh, it's shiny. It's the nuts and bolts. And that's the Michael Jordan nuts and bolts. And then I got this one here and this is some type of gold insert or something. I'm not really sure what year it's from. It's collector's choice, upper deck. And uh, it's JC11. So I'm not too familiar with this, but as I was looking through all of these, these were also in the pile. I figured, let me just pull them all out, show you some of these. Here's another early Jordan. This is also upper deck uh, crunch time, Michael Jordan. And that is also like a, I think it's like an insert, yes. It's CTO 540, which is crunch time. So some type of insert, not very expensive. None of these are really expensive. They're just, you know, some, you know, earlier uh, Jordan cards. And here's another, uh, this is a stadium club, Shining Moments. It has some glossy stuff. That's the 95, 96 season, so it's a 95 card. I don't know if this is like a gold one or something. It's different than the normal ones, but uh, that's another relatively uh, you know, younger, earlier Jordan card. Shiny Moments, SM2. So it's another Jordan card. And the last Jordan card I'm gonna show you before I open the, uh, that, this rare pack is this uh, Upper Deck Jordan. And this one is like a, I'm not sure exactly, it's an SP. Again, another shiny Jordan card. It's tough to see, but it does have a hologram of Jordan there. Let me pull it out and see if I can give you guys a better look at that hologram. There you go. So that's what it looks like here. It's a hologram of Jordan. These old holograms are really tough to, to get a good uh, good look at them. You know, this one obviously looks like it has some scratching and stuff, but you know. All these I pulled out of packs, so apparently that's how it came out of packs. And this is the, uh, the Jordan uh, SP, it's like from 95. I don't know what it means to have that old hologram. I'm not too familiar. If anybody's familiar with those, let me know. But this is uh, card number eight from the uh, from the SPX, I think it is. Jordan. So, anyway. So that's the ones that I kind of just pulled out and wanted to show you they were with the rest of my uh, my Jordans here. And then not uh, so this little box here, there's 33 cards. Go, go ahead and open this thing. And uh, let's see here, it's got like a little uh, thing to open it with here. So I'm gonna try to open it without uh, being careful not to really damage the little box because I really think the box is so cool with the uh, picture. Now these, you know, I showed you that the other cards, there were 30,000 printed of these. I mean, 50,000 50, graded of these. 
50,000 graded of these. Of these, there's tons more graded. I didn't even bother looking those up. But of these uh, NBA Estrellas, there's only about 5,000 printed. I mean, uh, graded. About 5,000 graded with, SG, with uh, PSA. So um, that's why I said it's a lot rarer. It's literally 10 times rarer. 10 times rarer than the other one. Than 10, yeah, there's 5,000 of these graded of each of these two uh, cards that are gonna be in here. And there's 50,000 of these. So that's why I say they're rarer. It's also 1988. And it's just, a, I wanna keep that box too. It's just a beautiful box. Beautiful card. So let's go ahead and check it out. Let's open this up. Let's see what we got in there. So we got some cards. And it's a deck of cards. And it says Juego Infantil. That means a child's game. So it's a child's game. That's where it's made from and from Spain. So let's pull out the cards and let's check them out. And like I said, they're they're game cards. So all the back look like that. And then the first card should be, yeah, it is, the Michael Jordan card from the, uh, and this is the instruction card. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in the, uh, in the hold and I'll show it to you, show you the back. So this is the only one that has any writing in the back because it's, it tells you the rules of the game. You see it was from 1988. So it's an early Jordan card, one of the rarer Jordan cards you're going to see. Only 5,000 uh, graded by PSA. So I never opened this since that time, but I'm opening it now. Maybe I'll get this graded and see what it will grade right out of the pack. Let's go ahead and put it away here. I'm going to take the two Jordan cards out of here. And then the other cards, I'm going to go ahead and just put them back in the box and save them. So um, that's, that's the Jordan game card, which is really the most desirable card in the deck. But let's take a look at it see what else we got in here. So... There is going to be another Jordan in here, but let's check it out. We got we got the number one card is Larry Bird. You've got uh, Robert Parrish. Let me lay that lay them here. I'm just number two, number three card is Kevin McHale. And I love these cards because they just have some great pictures. I mean, look at that! Look at that action shot. Awesome shot. Looks like he's getting fouled there. Maybe that's Isaiah Thomas pushing him in the back. They're great looking cards and they're very rare. You don't see too many of them. There's Magic Johnson. We got Kareem. Some nice cards. You probably haven't seen these too often. Like I said, it's, it's about one tenth of the amount graded by of the other cards of uh, of these, which is ninety. These are actually even older. Byron Scott. There's Isaiah Thomas. Adrian Dantley. So it's got all the stars of the of the day. That's a nice one there. That's uh, Kevin McHale guarding Adrian Adrian Dantley. Great pictures. These are pictures you normally don't see on on any tops cards or or any other cards are unique to this set only. That's a, a Spud Webb. It's a nice card of Spud Webb. One of the smallest guys in the NBA. Clyde Drexler, card number 11. So like I said, there's 33 cards in the set. The other Jordan should be coming up soon. I don't know what number it is. Terry Porter. Mark Aguirre. You got uh, Tyrone Bowes, 
the shortest guy ever. Well, him and, and uh, Spud Webb. So this got two of the short guys. You got Patrick Ewing. So it's a nice little set. Again, they're playing cards from Spain. Carl Malone. But from 1988, they're kind of tough to find. And there's Barkley doing that dunk. Nice pictures. If you hadn't seen these cards before, I just wanted to show them to you. I had another one of these before I opened them and sold them. And, and this one I had kept open. I mean, I had kept closed until today. Alex English, another Hall of Famer that people don't know too much about, but Alex English is a Hall of Famer. Xavier McDaniel. There's some great shots, good action shots here. Here's Jeff Malone, dribbling over there. Card number 21. There's the other Michael Jordan. Card number 22. Boy, they should have made that card number 23. But 23 happens to be Akeem. So let me go ahead and put this Jordan in a holder. And I'll give you another look at it. Card number 22. So this is the actual playing card of, of Michael Jordan, which is, a, again, another nice shot of Michael there doing a the layup. These are from 1988. So you got that one. And then the rest of the set is, uh, of course, Akeem, number 23, which really they should have made number card number 23, Jordan. But again, this was only a few years, a couple years, a few years after Jordan started. This was from 1988. So Jordan was relatively uh, a, young, uh, a young guy at that time. You had Ralph Sampson. Buck Williams, Chuck Person, Alvin Robertson. Great action shots though, I just love these cards. So if you hadn't seen these, I wanted to make sure you guys had a good chance to, to look at some rarer basketball cards that you may have not seen before. Paul Presley, again from 1988, so these are the players from 1988, and Danny Manning, LaSalle Thompson, and the last card is John Stockton. Nice shot of John Stockton there. So you have 33 cards in the set. 32 are the uh, game cards. And one of them is the uh, header card, the instruction card on how to play the game. And it tells you how to play the game in Spanish. So again, it's a 1988 card and along with the other 1988 Fourniers Estrellas NBA, NBA Stars cards. So these are the two most valuable cards in this set, the Michael Jordan regular card and the Michael Jordan uh, instruction card. So hope you guys enjoyed it. These are two more for my set. I'm gonna go ahead and put these away. And then this is the nice little box that it comes in. And uh, that's it, guys. So I hope you liked them. I'm gonna go ahead and put these right back where they were. But this now has been opened. So we'll put them back in the little box that I had them originally. Right there. So that's the uh, Estrellas NBA with the two uh, Michael Jordan. Only about 5,000 of these total have been graded by PSA. So I may go ahead and send these to get them graded and then uh, go from there. Maybe sell them eventually. All right, guys, thanks for watching my videos. Truly, truly appreciate it. I just wanted to show you some, uh, some a few of my um, earlier Michael Jordan cards and open this box of um, 1988 cards with, with two Jordans in there. So thanks for watching, guys. This is Orlando from A Collector's Dream. Have an awesome, awesome day.